Good morning all, I am Dr. P.J. Madam Rafi. Today we are going to discuss about amoebiasis and the treatment for amoebiasis. Okay. First of all, amoebiasis is caused by Antamoeba histolytica. Okay. There will be three types of amoebiasis. One is luminal amoebiasis, tissue amoebiasis, luminal plus tissue amoebiasis. Okay. Luminal amoebiasis means it is, in the, it is also called as intestinal amoebiasis. That means it will be only in presence in the intestine part only. Okay. So next is tissue means extra intestinal. Okay. That means whether it is in liver or other tissue. Extra intestinal part means it is tissue amoebiasis. If it is combined, obviously luminal plus tissue amoebiasis. Okay. So there are different types of drugs will be beneficial in different types of amoebiasis. If luminal amoebiasis, drugs will be deloxanide, paramomycin, idoquinol. Okay. But tissue amoebiasis, emetine and chloroquine. For both uh, luminal plus tissue combined amoebiasis, metronidazole, tinidazole and vorindazole. Okay. So here most important drugs will be this nitroamidazole group of drugs that is metronidazole, tinidazole and vorindazole. Okay. So here you have to remember the names of types of amoebiasis that is luminal tissue and luminal plus tissue. So what are the drugs? Mainly they are asking this, this only. And main one more drug is very, very important that is metronidazole. Okay. Nitronidazole is a nitroimidazole group drug. Okay. It is activated by reduction process that is in the hepatic metabolism. It underwent hepatic metabolism. Thereby it is get activated by reduction process and form cytotoxic product. This cytotactic product will damage the DNA of parasites. Okay. There it will kill the parasite. So there is drug of choice for metronidazole will be amoebic liver abscess, trichomoniasis, giardiasis, bacteria vaginosis, and pseudomembranous colitis mainly caused by Clostridium difficile. Okay. So these are all very, very important drug of choices. Okay. Amoebic, trichomonas, giardia, bacteria BV, uh, next colitis, pseudomembranous colitis, PMC. Okay. These are our drug of size of metronidazole. Okay. And this metronidazole, one more important MCQ is that is disulfiram reaction. It will cause disulfiram reaction when patient is taking along with alcohol. Okay. What are the other drugs will cause disulfiram reaction? Cephalosporins also will cause disulfiram and griseofalvin. Okay. This is an MCQ. Okay. So these are the drugs they will cause disulfiram reaction when you are combining with alcohol. Okay. Next, adverse effects of metronidazole. Mainly, it will cause nausea and metallic taste. This is an MCQ. Okay. It is a MCQ and triggering point. Okay. If there will be case scenario, they are asking something, disulfiram and the patient is uh, taking this medication, he is having symptoms like metallic taste means you have to think about metronidazole. Okay. It is a trigger point, triggering question point. Okay. So, adverse effect, nausea, metallic taste and abdominal cramps. This is regarding amoebiasis. Okay, here main thing will be types luminal, tissue, luminal plus tissue. Next important drug will be metronidazole. And what other drugs will be beneficial in different types of amoebiasis? That's all. That's all. Thank you.